What's going on new game in order this is Alex Lexus coming in at you like the juggernaut gonna be conducting the uh, this this video to uh, modify my mad cats um, I'm on the fence about desoldering anything from the main board because I don't want to avoid the warranty but um, you know, so I, I'm like a couple steps ahead. I removed the protective casing, and this is all of this in some way or fashion going to be wired up to the Brooks um, PCB. But uh, I'm just this is just the inspection phase to see what route I'm going to go, and because I still, you know, I don't have turbo function on this stick. It's pretty much you know, a straight, you know, lock and unlock, but with the Brooks, I'll be gaining those features. So I got a decision to make, um, but if I just go straight basic install, I'll have it done today and i uh, have my sister recording, but you know, this is just phase one inspection mode. On our new gaming order, I went ahead and decided to not wait and get the easy mod so what I did this is the PCB for the Mad Cat so I went ahead and cut all the wires and such and all the options I'm gonna apply later like for the turbo and all that good stuff but um, I have my 360 stick as a backup anyway but what I did was um, let me direct you I didn't want to use that port right here um, because it was kind of hard to get, I had to take it from my printer. So what I ended up doing, I was following the guide that pretty much told you what was what. So let me scroll up a little bit. Right here. Okay, if you want to use your existing um, header, which is what came with the Mad Cats, you just follow this guide right here. Now the thick black wire on this that's not required is actually the yellow all right so just bringing you in yeah the soldering is kind of tight but I got that in there so when you plug this in it's gonna read as an Xbox 360 stick as I will direct you yeah just bear with me doing this with one hand shit come on all right hold on. Windows 10 is kind of crazy, or something's pressing down on my keyboard. Alright, what the fuck? I wish I had the extra hand, but okay. Alright, so there you have it right here. Okay, so I'm going to take the end. Alright, I'm going to plug it in to my PC. And it reads as an Xbox One stick. It, it lights up. So the rest is as she wrote. So I kept, I'm going to keep the harnesses or probably use this and build another arcade stick with it. But uh, this is just phase two. Okay, now game in order. This is the next part of the phasing. So pretty much if you have. Uh, the scissor which I have on the bed you're gonna expose these wires and pretty much put it in the corresponding uh, man, it's kind of dark but everything is labeled it'll show you shit it's the light that's killing me but it'll show you pretty much uh, on the diagram what's what and you just line it up and I'll be back once I have a good amount of uh, progress done on it. What's going on in game in order? Um, I should have followed the tutorial, but I made a mistake. Um, 
and heads up you want to daisy chain the ground wire throughout the joystick because like each of these I actually like they have different ground points so what I ended up doing I took all the grounds and fused it into the A button wire and I'm gonna do the same for the punches I'll put it through a, a common ground and put it to the chip uh, I'm actually have like electric tape and you know it's just to streamline everything and, and keep it from having all these long messy wires but I'll have my diagram drawn out but uh, yeah uh, you know the tutorial videos Mm, if you're using the stock wiring uh, they don't tell you that but yeah that's something just all the kicks make sure you consolidate those into one ground and put it into the kicks it'll tell you on the board itself you know what I mean so um, that's where I'm at so I'm gonna do the punches and then I'll do a separate video uh, segment for the diagonal patch new game in order like I was saying before I went um, further pull all the grounds bring it to one point and use like a needle nose or use one of these cut it consolidate it and like the ex example right here fuse it so that um, you have that one ground for the kicks so I'm getting a little bit closer but just so you know um, so you don't run into the hassle that I did but most of the stuff is getting wired up now Whew. What's going on in Game of Order? This was a bitch. <laughs> well, for the, the D-pad, uh, I had trouble finding what was what uh, in terms of the ground and the uh, contact wires. Now, I went online trying to find everything, but uh, the wiring uh, diagram, I still have to do the home button. I think that's the last thing I got to do. All the LEDs are optional. Uh, I'm going to do that later. I just want to make sure that everything's up and running. But uh, I'm going to do a button test. All right. So we got the back button, start button. As you can see here, back and start. Next, we're going to have the light punch, light kick, as you can see. Light punch, light kick. All right, medium buttons, um, triggers, you got the trigger button and then you have the um, button six, you have L trigger and um, L bumper, so, so far so good. Um, you know, I can close it and actually show you. But I just want to make sure all is good. I'm going to get the zip ties and make it look nice. Um, like I did with the keeping the existing harness uh, to plug in. I didn't want to use this over here. If you can see that port. Because uh, they're old and they're hard to come by. So just solder that right to the board. And uh, you're good to go. Alright, so... Once I get the home button set, then uh, I'll start doing some tests. What's going on in Game of Order? Alex Lex is back. Um, testing out the the stick, but I had to make a couple of modifications. Um, I was on Sure You Can Tech Talk, and I couldn't get a question answered as to how to wire up my stock Mad Cat's uh, guide button. Or how to get the these set up as like turbo or whatever. But um, with that being said, I had a quick bypass. So um, I'm using this switch from an old arcade stick to do my guy button. Oh, I don't have it plugged in yet. But um, just showing you the progress. Uh, everything is wired up. Everything is working. Um, once all put into place I'm gonna like bed it properly and it should be good to go also what I ended up doing was you like I was saying in the other part of the video I'm using this stock um, Mad Cat's screw in piece so it's just a little more traditional so with that um, 
I'm gonna do like uh, some play testing, and I'll be back. What's going on, New Game in Order? Uh, we are testing this uh, the Brooks mod on the Xbox One. So far, we got the back for up down jab, light kick. Alright, medium kick, heavy punch, all three, all three, alright, we got the back button, and the start button, alright, so far everything seems to be working, now I lost the light for this and the LEDs up here, but I'll be revisiting that, um, and then the guide button, like I said, I had to do like a little thing here to get see if it's uh, up and running and so far so good so Xbox one test down and uh, I'll try the PS4 what's going on no game in order sad news at the very end of the project the board blew up apparently when I was trying to solder the or resolder the stock USB cable that came with the man cats. I should have just used this port because it worked, you know. But I wanted to kind of make it look seamless, so I'm actually gonna get this replaced. And uh, a whole day's worth of work fucked up. It's all good because what I'm gonna end up doing is replacing all the wires. And finding if there was a, you know, aside from trying to tighten the solder on there. But I would just say this, this works, it's worth it. Um, if you can do the plug and play, uh, it'd be better off. But I have had experience. I even went got a new soldering pen with a um, more fine tip. But something happened. Uh, the ground and the positive probably, you know, while it was hot made connection and freaking blew up so uh what that i mean having a shitty day and this ended up uh uh and all the extra tape i was trying to you know i had my zip ties ready i was, I was ready to go but uh it should happen this has been alex Texas new gaming order make sure you rate comment subscribe check us out on newgamingorder.com for the latest and greatest and by hook or crook once I get the replacement board, this fucker will be ready.